Exactly. Surprise, something very beautiful that you always are waiting for, I'm sure. Who is your recent crush, Reem? Who is my recent crush? Okay, so I... I don't know, but for me, if you talk about a crush, it's just never constant, you know, because uh, not in a personal life way, but yeah, hero heroines, I, I watch a movie, I like, I watch a music video and I have a crush on that guy, but uh, I think uh, Fawad Khan has been my crush, like he's been constant. Yeah. Nice, nice. Okay. Last one before we go to the second segment of the Bollywood quiz. A proud moment of yours that really made you realize that, yes, I am proud of myself. That moment. Hey, uh, you know, whenever I see that my parents are really proud of me, I really feel proud of myself. I think this is with every kid, uh, yeah. you know, it's with every kid, you know, whenever their parents, you know, say that, Beta, I'm proud of you. I think that's a moment where every child be, feels proud of, you know, itself. And the same goes for me. Uh, and also, you know, um, there was a point where my director, see, the thing is, uh, you know, whenever you do a project, more than the people who cast you or the people who are producing the show, you know, the person who's directing you, if that person says that I'm proud of you, you know, that's the moment of, of achievement. And, you know, I've recently I've worked with three directors and, you know, all of them, uh, they, they've loved me. They've always been very proud of me. But one such incident was that, uh, so uh, one of my directors, he was leaving the show due to some personal reasons. And when he was leaving, I was really sad because, you know, obviously, I was very close to him. Sanjay sir, Sanjay sir was directing the show. Uh, and when he was leaving uh, Tutsay Rapta, I was very sad and I was like, please don't do this, sir. He's like, listen, I'm leaving the show on your shoulders and I know you'll take oh. it. So that was the moment when I was so emotional because, you know, of course, Sanjay sir was leaving. But, you know, then he said such a big thing that, I'm leaving the show on your shoulders and if you don't have any work, you'll have to do it. You know, That's that how was, proud he was in you. Yeah, I, I felt, you know, I felt very responsible and I love feeling responsible. Uh, and yeah, that was one such moment. But That's proud. huge responsibility. But yeah. I mean, you and Sehba are doing an amazing job. People are loving you among all the globe. You know, the show has been dubbed in Arabic and people are loving it. And I I will send you that clip that you're talking in Arabic. It was a very cute clip. It's when you talk in Arabic and the dub in Arabic is very cute. <laughs> okay, now, are you ready for some Bollywood quiz? But before that, what's the upcoming project? Any music videos, uh, any show? <laughs> as such uh, no projects as such because you know i i was generally you know kind of thinking of considering a little vacation a little break so no uh, projects as such but inshallah something so inshallah something in your benefit inshallah okay bollywood okay two questions only first one are you ready name any three movie names that starts with the letter d that starts from the letter d d yeah Okay, Dil Chata Hai, Dil Dharakne Do, uh, Dil Wale Dhulani Ali Zayenge. Very beautiful. I'm, I'm telling you, it's very easy. Now, this might be a little bit tricky. Name a movie that stars Malika Sharawat and Sanjay Dutt together. Was it a double dhamal or something? You're a Bollywood movie buff, Baba. I can't be a mom like that. I very am. beautiful and very quick. Mashallah. Now to the last with the cultural exchange. Now we, as I mentioned earlier, that we love India. So please talk about India and why Arabs should visit India. Uh, because India is all about culture. You get to see different cultures together, and it's beautiful. Because you know, ever since uh, humans, we've been fat, you know fighting one battle, which is you know different cultures how they don't get along together. And, you know, uh, intercaste marriage is like, I come from a family which has an intercaste marriage. You know, like my dad, he, he is Sheikh, my mom is Sharma. So for me, I would only want people to come to India is because if you want to see how different cultures can live together beautifully, I think you should come and visit India. This is a very beautiful message that you have sent, you know, across. This is a very beautiful cultural thing. 